Hello, everyone. I'd like to begin by thanking Christopher Rose and the Book Selection Committee for choosing Benny's War. Writing is lonely work, and the bookshelf is crowded with gems. It means so much that you picked Benny's War for this award. The mission of the Middle East Outreach Council is to promote understanding of the Middle East. That is a beautiful and worthwhile mission, and it's why I write my books as well. I've, I have felt that over the years, I have felt that the link between a rush to judgment and a lack of understanding has grown ever closer. It's easy to judge something when it's a two-dimensional caricature. It's harder to judge something when it's vibrant, complicated, and real. I did a lot of research to make sure that Benny's War while exciting and compelling, remained rooted in accuracy and authenticity. I read historians' accounts. I went to the Library of Congress and read newspapers from that time period so I could see how events unfolded in real time. I spoke with nearly half a dozen former Israeli soldiers uh, and their family members, including retired generals and ex-POW and my own parents. I traveled to Israel and I visited the Golan Heights and I spoke with founding members of the Mashav that were built there in the early 1970s. And I talked with them about their time during that Yom Kippur War in 1973. I wasn't able to write the book until I had filled myself to the brim with facts and feelings, with all of the complicated, beautiful and brutal memories they had shared with me. I am so grateful that the passion, the energy, and the effort that went into writing the story has touched your hearts. I am so honored to receive the Middle East Book Award for Youth Literature. Thank you.